I had a phone call from uh, a mate of mine and just come down and have a look at this. And so I came back with this. This was a, a blown up manifold. One of the other teams had got rid of it because it's, they'd had a pretty major explosion. We got it for next to nothing. So uh, we got somebody up to do some magnesium welding in here. And uh, we've just, where the welding was, we've just cut it over with liquid metal. I think it'll do the job. I mean, it is, I've never had a problem with it before and the way we've done it. But we just, we'll see. The proof of the pudding's in the eating, but you know, for a very reasonable price, we got it. When it got back here, this was all a little bit warped. Now we have a, have a plate that we have made, sent in, surfaced, so it's flat with good quality wet and dry on it. And that we put on the surface of the manifold and we make sure that this manifold is over and over until this manifold is dead flat. That way, when you, with the supercharger, you're only looking at one to two thou clearance on the rotors to the case. If you've got this, if this is not dead flat, it will try and warp the case of the supercharger. A is the same as on the case of the supercharger. We flatten that and just make sure it is dead flat. Once again, otherwise it will just tear up the strips. It will just, you'll cause um, damage to the rotor blades itself. And it is, so we do this, flatten all of this. This has to have an O-ring. This was different to our other manifold. Our other manifold had this cut out in here. So I've modified it. May not look pretty, but at least it's, it works the same as the other manifold. Um, on the sides here, they were still pretty flat. So we should be good. So I've just installed our, these are our idle jets in here. We, you can either idle through the manifold or you can idle through the cylinder heads. Um, I tend to idle through the manifold with the cylinder heads there. We've just got check nozzles in the, the cylinder heads that as soon as you're off of idle and you hit the throttle, it is, you're just, it opens up the ones in the cylinder heads as well. We've got this block here, which fits on the back. Um, with the fuel lines on here as well we have these fuel lines these two outlets here these go to the cylinder heads the rails through the cylinder heads this one on the top here is fed from the the top uh, block on just behind the injector with there and the main feed comes through here so this one goes up to the injectors for the top nozzles 